Welcome to MarcusG.TV. I'm Chef Marcus Giuliano. I'm a chef on a mission. Today's mission is business. You can find all my business tips, coaching, critiques, hints um, on 50mistakes.com. 50mistakes.com is a website to go to. And that, my friends, is about 100 videos strong of all kinds of free business tips. You can go there for any business, specifically restaurants, because I'm a restaurateur, I'm a chef, but a lot of the stuff I'm preaching relates to all types of businesses. Well, I'm here to tell you today that your business is worth shit. Yes, your business is not worth what you think it's worth. And here's why, okay? A lot of you fall into this category, a ton of you. I was just at a restaurateur, I was just at a restaurant the other day that wanted to sell, a couple in there, mid 70s early early to mid 70s they've been in the restaurant business for 40 years they put blood sweat and tears into what they've done they've raised kids in the restaurant and they're getting ready to retire and they're trying to sell their restaurant of course they own the real estate so the real estate is worth something but the business aspect they're like we want this much for the business so i'm like but what what is the business Here's the one thing they are lacking. They don't understand. A lot of people don't understand this. It doesn't matter if you're 30 or 75. You need to understand this principle. You need a database. If you don't have a database, your business is worth shit. Plain and simple, okay? That's the bottom line. You need a database. You might you might have a, a glorious restaurant, a great name, this and that. New owners, new management. Who knows what's going to happen, right? When you have a database, that is key. In my restaurant, I have thousands and thousands of people on a database where I can send them an email and say, hey, we're doing this now. We're trying this. Or, hey, welcome the new owners. The new owners are these fantastic people that are taking over this business with tons of energy. And they're going to do X, Y, and Z. And they're here to, to do this, this, this the same exact way, or they're gonna revolutionize this business and totally take it to the next level, and they're gonna blow it up, and they might not do anything the same, they might do everything the same. But if you don't have a database, it's so much harder to do that. So much harder. So I was talking to this couple, and I'm like, do you have a database? And of course, well, we don't have a database. We don't have time to do a database. You've been here for 40 years. What do you mean you don't have time to do a database? You delegate that out. You hire somebody eight, nine bucks an hour, 10 bucks an hour. You delegate it to a virtual assistant in India for seven bucks an hour. I don't care how you do it. You do it. You put a comment card at the table at the end of the meal. You get people's comment. You solicit their feedback. What's good? What's bad? What's your birthday? What's your address? What's your name? What's your email address? And you create a stack of these. A stack. If you have nothing to do beyond that, it's just a stack. But if you want to hire somebody at eight, nine, ten bucks an hour, then that person will sit there every week for two hours, maybe, maybe three, maybe one, and take all these people and put them into a database, into a spreadsheet. And then you might upload it to Constant Contact or MailChimp, one of those other mail servers that then can send that email out every week to your to your fans and nurture your fans and say, you know what, here's an offer for coming into our restaurant the first time. Here's another great offer. Here's what we're doing for Thanksgiving. Oh, by the way, we're closed for Christmas, but join us for the new year because we're having this great big celebration. I, can't, I just can't get this through people's heads enough. Your database is everything. What if your restaurant burnt down tomorrow, burnt to the ground? What if you were gonna open that same restaurant five miles away? How are you going to tell everybody? By chance. That's the only way unless you have a database. Now, I know a lot of you are very diligent. And a lot of you have great databases. A lot of you manage your databases. But I got to tell you, that's not the norm at all. People don't, don't understand the value of a database. If I were to sell my restaurant, I would say, you know what? Here's my database. This is it. It's this thick. Here's all the emails I've sent. Here's my communication tools to anybody who's walked in my door that was willing to give me their email address. Here's all the stuff. There you go. New owners, here's your direct marketing list. It's six times easier to get somebody into your restaurant for the second time than it is the first time. And restaurateurs don't understand that. Okay? There's a lot of competition out there. 
And people aren't loyal like they used to be. People used to be loyal, loyal, loyal. And a few of those people still exist, those guests. But it also used to be on loyalty. Now it's like, oh, the restaurant down the street's gonna give us a free drink? They're gonna give us 10% off? They're gonna give me a birthday dessert? I'm there. But then when the next restaurant does the same thing, I'm there. And the way, the way you do that is by communicating to your database. Okay, I'm really excited about this because this is really like, like how you build your business. This is how you do it, people, okay? Facebook's great, Twitter's awesome, Instagram is leading the way, Snapchat's right behind in the top three, YouTube's fantastic, but you need to be able to send a tangible email to somebody, a postcard in the mail, and say, this is for you, my friend. This is for you for being a valued guest. This is for you, this is what we're doing. Restaurant guests. They like to hear from their favorite restaurant every 22 days, every three weeks. They wanna hear something, whether it's a mailing or an email. They wanna hear something that's to them or else they're gonna find another restaurant that is talking to them. That's the bottom line. You have to talk to your guests. And it's all not a sales pitch. It's all not, this is for sale, this is on sale, this is a great deal. It's gotta be educational, it's gotta be fun, it's gotta be, hey, this is my family vacationing in Italy. This is us here. This is, hey, you know what? We just brought this brand of, of vodka in because we love the distillery and it's 15 minutes away from us or an hour away from us. We met the owners and we have a personal relationship. See, we're shaking hands with them. This is great. We can relate to them. Without a direct sales pitch is the best, okay? A lot of restaurants are guilty of just sales pitch after sales pitch after sales pitch after sales pitch after sales pitch, after sales pitch and people turn you off at that point. Okay, so there's a whole fine line about managing a database. So I suggest you get over to 50mistakes.com, 50mistakes.com, or F-I-F-T-Y, mistakes.com. I have both domain names. Um, look at my videos. Shoot me an email if you have any questions. Help at 50mistakes.com is the website, is the email address. Help at 50mistakes.com. Send me an email. I'm happy to help. In fact, I'll give you 15 free minutes on the phone with me talking about anything on that website that you want to talk about. I guarantee you 15 minutes, 15 free minutes of my time can make you thousands of dollars. I guarantee that or else it's free. It's free to begin with, right? But I want to show you the way. I want to point you to tools that are going to make a difference. This is a much better offer than Geico. Okay, 15 minutes can save you 15%. Screw the 15%. I can make you thousands of dollars. By watching this video, in the last 10 minutes, if you start a database and start commuting to that database, you will make thousands upon thousands upon thousands of dollars annually. It, no, there's, there's just no, no doubt in my mind that that's what will happen. That's plain and simple. Get on the site, email me, 50mistakes.com, email me, 15-minute free consult, and I will spend 15 minutes with you on the phone. Of course, you have to call me. Um, even though long distance is kind of free nowadays, right? But I get emails from all over the world on this website. So um, if you think I'm calling Germany or Thailand or, or Nigeria or South Africa, I, I'm not going to do that. But you call me, you Skype me, I'll talk to you. We'll, we'll, we'll spend 15 minutes and we'll jump into the goods right away. I love sharing what I know. I've been doing this for a long time and I'm very passionate about what I do. I have a small restaurant in a small community that's thriving over the last 13 years where the business logistics, the business demographics are not there, but I'm doing it. I've been doing it. I've been written up, up and down all over it. I speak about this. I'm, I've spoken international about this, about marketing a restaurant. Marketing your restaurant is key. I'm a chef. I'm a restaurant owner, but first thing when I do when I walk into my restaurant is I market my restaurant every day. I'm a marketing maniac. So join me over at 50mistakes.com and uh, shoot me an email, tell me what you think, but get that database going if you don't do anything with it. And I said to this, this business owner, I said, you know what, for the next month, for the next month, everybody who comes in comes into your, into your restaurant for the next month, holiday parties, everything, you're gonna be busy. Get their email. I don't care what you do with it. Put it in a shoebox. Then when the, the new owners come next year, whenever they're going to come, hand them the shoebox and say, here you go. These people were in the restaurant. They liked it. They gave me their email. They were kind enough to give me their contact information. Oh, yeah, and their birthdays are there, too. If you send them an offer, they're definitely going to be in, right? Because people love birthdays. I'm Chef Marcus Giuliano. Thanks for watching this video. If you like my videos, please hit like, subscribe to my channel, and uh, definitely reach out to me. Shoot me an email. Leave me a comment.